Hi, my name is D. Sri Chandraradi of Data Science C section. Uh, so I am telling about my C language tech talk topic reversing of an integer of solving a problem. So, so my uh, question is given an integer and to write a program to reverse it. So how can I write to reverse the given integer into the C programming language? So first, C program to reverse a number. In this example, you will learn to reverse the number entered by the user. To understand this example, you should have the knowledge of the following C programming topics. C programming operators, C while and do while loop. So while writing this program or question, we have to know about the C programming operators or C while and do while loop. In this the big blog post we learn how to write a C program to reverse the digits of a given number or integer how to find reverse an integer any number using loop in a C program logic to find the reverse of a number in C programming how to write a C program to reverse a number without using loop how to write C program using, a, using an array how to write C program to reverse a number using function let's see an example so we can define a uh, I, we can write the C, uh, C program in different ways while writing the reverse of a integer doing uh, using array by list uh, tuples like this next uh, reverse again using functions and with using loops and without loops how can we write next. suppose I'll take an example of input num 1 2 3 4 5 so the output will be 5 4 3 2 input number 1 2 3 4 5 so the output will be 5 4 3 2 1 same like another example input of num is equal to 876 so output will be 678 so algorithm to reverse a number so uh, while writing this uh, so by writing a program to reverse a number we have to write the first algorithm flowchart and code and how it executes the code so this process I will cover by using the presentation. So the first algorithm to reverse a number. First ask the user to enter any number. So generally we ask any user to enter a number. Second declare and initialize another variable reversed with zero where reversed an integer variable. So uh, take the temporary number as uh, as the variable with zero and when reverse an integer variable get the last digit of the given number by performing the modulo division so we want to uh, just take the number like 1 2 3 4 5 and by performing the last number 5 divide with modulo division of 10 and store the value at last digit variable li likely last digit equal to number uh, percentage of 10 so next multiply uh, reversed by 10 and add last just multiply the reverse by 10 and add last digits like reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus the last digit next divide a number by 10 like uh, given the number you have to divide with by 10 next repeat the steps 3 to 5 till the number is not equal to or greater than 0 so by using this algorithm or this process we have to write the code and write the flowchart to execute this program so just follow the algorithm wise program you get the uh, given out, uh, get the output next flowchart to find the reverse of a number so uh, to write the flowchart first uh, the main point is start with a oval shape now to start with a oval shape with start and end with the uh, end with oval shape oval shape sorry next uh, start number or uh, reversed uh, so the i'll take an example of number one two three four so number comma reverse one two three four comma zero so i'll take zero reverse is equal to zero and number is equal to one two three four next the last digit of the number uh, so as i said before in algorithm the last digit should be divided by 10 so same here last digit should be equal modulo number modulo division by 10
next reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus the last digit how to give the instruction is reverse is equal to uh, reverse into 10 plus the last digit of the number uh, next the number you have to number is equal to number modulo divided by 10 so number you have to divide with 10 so the same as if the number equal to 0 uh, s will be printed reversed if no the last digit equal to number first of 10 so the loop continues if the number is not equal to 0 and print reverse has to be in parallel gram and the decision of the statement is if should be mentioned in flowchart is diamond shape so this is the flow uh, and next the uh, if the print uh, if the given number is equal to zero print uh, it prints the reverse of a given number and the end will be printed uh, so this is the flowchart to find a reverse of a number by using algorithm and flowchart and uh, programming we can find the uh, we can write the program or a code uh, which gets the output of a reverse number next C program to find a reverse of a number so uh, what is the program to write uh, to be given a reverse number uh, we have written a algorithm flowchart same uh, as the same i mentioned in algorithm and flowchart same as uh, mentioned in c programming code so first hashtag include stdio.h we use stdio.h uh, to header uh, file of the program code next we have to give the condition of int of main so int is uh, integer we mentioned uh, so my topic is also in uh, reverse and integer so I'll take any integer to find. So I mentioned int of int in main uh, brackets. Next flower bracket open flower bracket int. I'll mention int of n is integer, and uh, if the number is reverse, reverse also an integer and the remainder. So we have talked about the uh, in algorithm and uh, uh, algorithm and in. Uh, flowchart remainder uh, remainder equal to uh, n modulo 10 so remainder should also give an output so remainder is also an int value next uh, print f enter an integer so i'll enter an integer to uh, reverse the uh, i will ask the pro computer to enter the given number enter an integer next scan f of percentage d ka in and n so so we use scanf to locate the where the uh, uh, number is asking in python we use and uh, print enter a number so that's enough to uh, print the number of a given number in python but in c language we use the uh, number we will ask the number by scan using scanf and the percentage d is the uh, the number which we give an integer is the we use scan uh, percentage g when we use uh, float we use percentage of f and next and n is the address of an integer what the integer is located so next using while using while n not equal to 0 so uh, while using loop I can write a program same as algorithm and flowchart a uh, file n uh, n not equal to 0 when n not equal to 0 so the remainder equal to n percentage of d so the remainder uh, i'll ask the remainder to uh, uh, remainder is a variable so i will ask remainder variable as n uh, divided with 10 percentage of 10 next reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus remainder so we ask re, uh, reverse uh, I want to take the number integer reverse so reverse is equal to reverse into 10 uh, multiply with 10 plus remainder what will get before the remainder will add it to the remainder to the reverse next uh, n equal to n divided by 10 so uh, 
नेक्स्ट क्लोज ब्रैकेट नेक्स्ट प्रिंट एफ रिवर्स नंबर परसेंटेज इज रिवर्स सो द एंटर्स नंबर विल बी रिवर्स सो द रिवर्स नंबर विल बी आस्क एंड प्रिंटेड लाइक रिवर्स नंबर परसेंटेज दी सेम एस एड परसेंटेज इज लोकेट विद इंटीजर एंड परसेंटेज एफ इज फ्लोट नंबर एंड परसेंटेज ई इज दर्स एस इज द स्ट्रिंग नेक्स्ट रिटर्न जीरो इफ नॉट इट इट विल रिटर्न जीरो इज क्लोज ब्रैकेट so same as the program executed in uh, com- uh, in compiler in dev plus plus same as using as include uh, is for stream or uh, we can use sd or uh, ios for stream next using namespace std std by using uh, same std io <laughs> using namespace std int of main and percentage int number remainder reverse is equal to zero as i said before we use int as a integer we ask number and we'll get a remainder name integer and the reverse also will get an integer so i will taking a temporary variable called reverse is equal to zero next count count uh, greater than uh, uh, please and a number that you want to reverse so we'll ask in the number to on on to reverse see greater than a number by using while loop uh, number greater than 0 next uh, open the flower. after while loop we should not uh, be use colon like in python in c language we should not use any uh, 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 colon in while or for loop or if else conditions next remainder is equal to num percent of 10 no. next reverse is equal to reverse into 10 so the remainder we use as a variable is uh, to determine the remainder by using uh, model of 10 there with 10 we enter the uh, suppose 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 uh, uh, percent of 10 means model division we'll get uh, 1 2 3 4 the file will be removed in percentage divide more we should uh, we get only quotient the remainder is equal to num- number divided by 10 next reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus remainder number is equal to number divided by 10 same as we discussed in the previous code next count you have to close the loop and next count uh, hashtag uh, hash and in indicates the it prints next line reverse of a given number so it gives the reverse of a given integer and return zero so for example please enter any number that you want to reverse i will run this code so 2 3 4 5 next the reverse of a given number is 5 4 3 2 next this program takes an integer input from the user then the while loop is used until n factor equal to 0 is false it uh, false when n equal to 0 so it takes n not equal to 0 in each iteration of the loop the remainder when n is divided by 10 is calculated and the value is n reduced by 10 times inside the loop the reverse number is computing using reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus remainder so let us see how the while loop works when n is equal to 2 3 4 5 so n will take n equal to 2 3 4 5 n not equal to 0 it's it's true next the remainder will be 5 so reverse 0 into 10 plus 5 is equal to 5 next 2 3 4 next it's true next remainder 4 5 into 10 in plus 4 is equal to 54 next 23 true next the remainder is 3 so 54 into 10 plus 3 into 5 is equal 543 same as next 2 true 2 and next 543 into 10 plus 2 5432 5, next 0 so in, it will be false so the loop terminates and exists so by using the function it is uh, int into in reverse of digits of int number int reverse is equal to 0 while number greater than 0 reverse is equal to reverse into 10 plus number so number is equal to number add by 10 so int of main int number reverse is equal to 
print f enter any number scan f uh, percent of dn number reverse is reverse into digits reverse digits of number print reverse print return 0 so output will be the enter any number 1 2 3 4 and the reverse is 4 3 2 1 so finally the reverse variable which contains the reverse number is printed on the screen so thank you for the explaining for giving chance to explain this video thank you